Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will try to understand why we need to use Azure Data Lake. So the first thing is Azure Data Lake embraces open source or rather I should say Microsoft embraces open source. The reason is the entire Azure Data Lake suite is built on top of open source technologies like Apache Yarn and WebHDFS. The second thing is you can just bring your on-premises data to Azure and really worry about nothing. So you can store trillions of objects and petabyte size files and really need not worry about anything. You only pay for what you store. Massively parallel processing. So Azure or Data Lake provides this capability of massively parallel processing so you only need to worry about how to parallelize the job and nothing about how to handle the existing infrastructure. And the fourth thing is the data lake scales instantly and you just pay the time the job runs. For example, today I have a data set which is one terabyte size in file and tomorrow the size grows to 10 terabytes. I just need to increase the number of allocation units or analytic units and your job just works. Azure Data Lake is built with security in mind. So when the data is moving, it is secured with the help of SSL and when the data is at rest, you have keys generated for that and you can encrypt with those keys and you can store those keys in Azure Key Vault. In addition to that, Data Lake also provides role-based access controls and multi-factor authentication and you can manage millions of objects using Azure Active Directory. And finally, it just works with the existing infrastructure because your data lake is part of Cortana Intelligence Suite. So if you already are working with Azure uh, Data Warehouse or SQL Azure and you just your data lake just works because it's part of Cortana Intelligence Suite. So you really need not worry about kind of compatibility issues between what you have already and data lake the existing infrastructure just works so enough of all the theory in the next video we will go and see a practical demo thank you